Hello everyone, Bombblast here. So today we will be taking a look at this guy. Modified Blast Troll is named Sniper and can be played in game. Let's take a look at his abilities. Ability 1 is a shot of his gun. This seems to be a shotgun type weapon. Ability 2, Sniper throws down a claymore which explodes upon impact of any enemy. Ability 3 is of course a sniper. I'm 100% sure this is why he is named sniper these are some pretty cool attacks and definitely some we haven't seen before also once putting him onto the portal his troll model does not appear but a red slash fire dragon does this model is the same one we saw when toys for bob showed us Thrones kingdom beta build sniper can only be played through file swapping you may ask what is file swapping well it's pretty simple all you have to do for example is rename gilgrunts dot arc and dot bld files with eg spyro and then once in game, you will place Gilgrunt on the portal and you uh, have Spyro instead of Gilgrunt. <laughs> so yeah, you also may ask, can Sniper be put onto an NFC card? Sadly, he cannot. He doesn't have a character ID like any other Skylander. I do not know why he still remains in the files of the final game. But we do know, thanks to the Skylander Giants alphas, that he's still present in there as well. But possibly, he might have just been in the works to be an actual Skylander, but scrapped very early on. Or he might have just been a test Skylander. Sniper is in all versions of Skylander Giants, so Xbox 360, PS3, Wii, Wii U. If we check his upgrades, they just show up as Spyros, display a generic name and description. In a Sniper, there is a glitch that occurs when using his sniping attack. He isn't supposed to be shown out of the shrubs, but sometimes he glitches out and can move around. What do you guys think of Sniper? It's pretty weird that he was kept in the files of the final game. Do you guys want to be shown more Skylanders and interesting things that were kept in the files of these games? Let me know.